Hey guys, Tori Ann Perky here, and from my homeschool to your homeschool, I want to tell you why I am not homeschooling anymore. Okay, except I am, but not right now. You guys, it's May. May. Like, the birds are chirping, and the weather is amazing, and I don't want to be schooling anymore, and neither do my kids. And for years, years, I mean, I've been doing this a long time, almost 14, 15 years, for a long, long time, I was like, we've got to plug through May, and I would plan stuff for May, and I would make it happen, and then it wouldn't happen, and then I would feel guilty, and I'd be like, oh, I failed. I just don't do that anymore. I know that when May happens, we are going to be super busy outside, the kids are going to want to relax, and they have activities that have stuff in May as well. So we just don't do a lot of homeschooling in May. I kind of kind of check out at the end of April and and just take a break. I mean, we educate and we're learning all the time. We learn in June. We learn in July. We learn in August. We're schooling year round. It just doesn't look like, you know, pen and paper book work. So if we take some time off in May to just relax and enjoy the weather, yeah, I am totally fine with that. So I'm not homeschooling anymore right now. Like right now, we are on vacation. <sighs> It feels awesome. Will I pick it back up? Absolutely. I love homeschooling. I love it. But right now in May, I love other things too. So that's what we're doing right now. So if you're feeling a little frustrated, you're feeling a little bit like, what's wrong with me? Because I don't want to do this and my kids don't want to work anymore, but we've got to charge through. Can I encourage you that maybe there's a different way to approach your May? Maybe just a little bit. You'll probably be a lot happier. I'm Tori M. Perky, and I make these videos every week so that you can be a super successful and confident homeschool mom.